after about an eight hour drive, we finally made it to the Gorilla Mist Lodge in the Buendi Impenetrable Forest, where we're very excited to do some gorilla tracking tomorrow. Along the way, we saw many new birds, butterflies. There was a whole puddling group of butterflies that we spent some time with on the way in, right after the entrance to Buendi. <laughs> The Gorilla Mist Camp is located in the heart of the windy impenetrable forests, close to the entrance for where the gorilla trekking occurs. This is certainly one of the main attractions in the area. The lodge itself has some incredible views from all of the rooms and gorgeous sunrises and sunsets are not uncommon. The rooms are a bit basic but have everything you'll need for a comfortable stay. Today is the day we've been looking forward to for a very long time. We're about to head out and we're about to go to the headquarters where we'll be briefed on safety procedures and the do's and don'ts. So the trek can take anywhere from a half hour to four hours. Uh, it just depends on where the groups are that we're trekking today. Uh, so we're gonna head up there pretty soon and get going. Before our safety briefing, we enjoyed an excellent performance by the local community. This is another female, AF means other female, other female. Mm -hmm. And then we have what we call Sabadat. Sabadat, the Sabadat male, this is a Sabadat male. Sabadat males uh, between six and eight. And then we have juveniles between three and six. And then these are two juveniles and infant. They mistakenly wrote juvenile, but this is an infant. Uh, you can see even the color, it's brown. Mm -hmm. Uh, we took this photo when uh, it was a few days, just uh, not more than a week, and she looked like this. We have another baby who is not on this poster, because the baby was born when you had already developed this. So there are two infants in the group. Uh, they have names. Infants are actually between one second, I would say, three years. Is, uh, about water. Don't forget water. Uh, don't forget packed lunch. Don't forget a raincoat. Yeah? Okay. And I have seen you have tucked in your pants. Yeah. Don't you? Yeah. Your pants. Okay. So that you don't get disturbed by the ants. Okay. Hiking through the windy, impenetrable forest, looking for mountain gorillas. We're catching up with the trackers that left early this morning to track down the mountain gorilla group that we're looking for today. You can probably see why it's called the windy, impenetrable forest. Very, very thick vegetation all around us. Really muddy, wet trails. But this is the habitat that the gorillas like. So we've been hiking for only about 10 minutes so far. Some of the terrain is pretty steep, but not too bad. Walking sticks are available for anyone who needs it, but the forest is just absolutely incredible all around. Lots of birds singing, uh, really nice hike so far.
one of the things you can do to support the local community is hire a porter to carry your bag for you. Uh, so that's what I've done. The price is about 15 US dollars. Uh, and then of course you're able to tip them as well. I would highly recommend it, not only because it makes the hike easier, but it also supports the locals, encourages conservation of the mountain gorillas here. So it seems like a very worthwhile thing to do. So we just heard from the trackers that they found the gorillas. Doesn't sound like they're very far away, so we're getting pretty close. finished our allotted time with the gorillas. <laughs> what an amazing experience. We saw about 10, including the silverback and two babies. Uh, babies were playing. It took us quite a while to find them. We had to go way off the beaten path. They were finishing up eating for the morning and we found them resting under some trees, vegetation. And they just sat there, slept, watched us. Definitely once in a lifetime experience. This is not an easy hike. The gorillas were not on the main trail. Like I said, we had to go way, way down a steep cliff and then back up. But totally, totally worth it to watch these mountain gorillas in the wild. There's nothing like it.